Away we go. This is the cosmic eye that will form the major component of the James Webb Space Telescope, the gigantic successor to the Hubble Telescope. Following a three-month testing period in Oxfordshire, which saw a team of more than 50 scientists working 24 hours a day and seven days a week, this pioneering mid-infrared instrument, or MIRI, is now complete. And once James Webb is launched in 2018, MIRI will allow scientists to look further into the universe than ever before. While the Hubble enables us to look at galaxies as far away as 12.7 billion light years, Webb will see as far as 13.4 billion, almost to the Big Bang itself. Some of the most exciting open questions in astronomy can only be answered by an instrument like Webb. So for example, when did the first stars and first galaxies form in our universe? How do stars like our sun and planetary systems form? Uh, and what these planets that we see going around distant stars, what they're like, how much they're like our Earth. But with a predicted cost of £4 billion being footed by NASA and the European and Canadian space agencies, it's vital that tests are rigorous because there'll be no way of repairing it once it's in space. We have to make sure that it works first time, every time, and is going to operate for 10 to 15 years with no human intervention. And unlike Hubble, there's no chance of fixing James Webb. So we have to be sure when it launches it will work.